Good old hip hop. Now we know we haven't been doing that much music reviews lately, um, but we had to stop everything we're doing uh, because Wendy's ha had to just drop fire on everybody. Had to break the internet um, and drop this mixtape called "We Beefing," um, where they just pretty much stopped the internet gold, and everybody had to go and rush to listen to this. Um, and I mean, first of all, the, the whole, you know, they, they pay respect and homage to classic legendary hip hop by the cover of We Beefing is the N Notorious B.I.G. Ready to Die. They make a play on that cover. Um, and they're actually rapping about narratives of fries, of shakes, of deals at Wendy's, you know, four, four for four. You know, you, you know, how much, you know, meals you can get for just four dollars at Wendy's. And they're throwing shots at McDonald's. Um, what did now? What did you think about this when I sent you the link to this? Uh, I listened to it. Uh huh. It's super short. It's only about ten minutes. Yeah. And it was okay. Okay. Is it that... wasn't great. It wasn't bad. The beats were okay, and the lyricism was fairly average. Yeah, I mean that's pretty much an apt way to describe it um it i mean it doesn't really sound that much different from a lot of music that's the, i mean a lot of trap stuff that's out um and it's super generic trap rap it's it's yeah. like picking the beats off the internet um and grabbing sounds like a, any kind of rap album you find on like soundcloud yeah sounds very much like a soundcloud rap album yeah, like you like some weak SoundCloud rapper that you'll just boring scroll and you'll hear this type of stuff. Um, and I appreciate they actually got a, like a female rapper to do it because you know Wendy's is a, usually a, a female name, so they actually got like a female rapper to do it. I I just I just I have to interview her because I was like, how did you not laugh every time he was saying these <laughs> lyrics? Um, you know, rapping about fries and shakes and you know you know a McDonald's ice cream machine being broke. Like, how did you not? laugh every single time you were saying these lines i just really want to know that um and this is not the first time wendy's has actually dealt with music and dealt with incorporating music into their into their products uh like the famous uh wendy's grill skills rap where it's teaching you <laughs> how to grill but don't be slow just turn them over easily we don't want a broken penny that's a guarantee press out the corners one two three four rock it a bit are oh, you keeping score top and bottom left and right first of all you could tell this is very 80s like very like run dmc like oh know, yeah they got that beatboxing a nice beatboxing it's almost like somebody should have just pulled out a cardboard box and have somebody spin on it um because they just they should have just had that in there um because yeah, this is like really super old school. And then you sent me one. I did. Well, there's they're talking about a hot drink training video of how to yeah. pour. Which I don't need. I don't know why you need that. I mean, can't you? Don't you just you know, set up the machine and pour it in? No, in no. Cup? It goes through every single lyrics of how to exactly do it. Now I like this one. This one's kind of funky. I like. No, this yeah, one. no. Everyone agrees that "Hot Drinks" is genuinely a, d a good, catchy song. Yeah, th this one kind of goes off. I like this one. This is kind of fun. I like listening to this. Okay. <laughs> well, who does that? Yeah, the guy. Who's yeah, the guy hot. in the video is great. Yeah, hot, hot. But you haven't got to the chorus. You got to get to the chorus. Okay, let me get to the chorus here. All right. Okay. <laughs> oh wow yeah like that's that's kind of nice i like that that's yeah. kind of got a nice beat to it okay mm -hmm. 
Yeah, Wendy, Wendy's is out here, man. You know, really serving up the. They they did they nice little R and B. They did some classic hip hop. Now they doing trap. You know, they going with the ages, man. They 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 evolving. They do. You know, it's coming. You know, but you know, some better than others. They're not uh, one of the first people ever do because Hamburger Helper. You know, he also dropped some fire. You know, with his own mixtape. He did. What a a while back. That was really enjoyable, really fun to listen to. Uh, Did you ever listen to the Hamburger Helper one? I did. I believe he sent me a link for it once. Yeah, that that was pretty good. Let me play. Let me see if I can play a little bit of the Hamburger Helper one. Um, because listening to it, I was trying to compare it to that one. Like, which one is better? Uh, which one is more of a disgrace to hip hop? Um, trying to really decide. <laughs> um, you know, which one is really just the death of all hip hop? Let's see. It's hard to really tell sometimes. Now I like I think I like this one better. This one this one kinda goes hard. Right. I ain't gonna lie, like this one really good. This dude compared is really the, Oh yeah, it, compared to the uh beefing, this one that's going hard on it. Yeah, like this, this one, this dude is really into making hamburger helper. You could tell, like he's yeah. got real life experiences making hamburger helper. Like exactly. he really knows his shit. That's how. That's what got him through all those uh, previous times when he was trying to make it through. Yeah, I mean, you know, when life was rough, hamburger helper was there for him. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, like, I mean, you know, this is this is a joke mostly. I mean, you know, a lot of people, you know, it's good marketing for Wendy's. Um, and you know, Wendy's also has a really good Twitter account. I don't know who runs their Twitter account. Whoever runs that, that person is winner of the internet so many times in a row at this point. Yeah. I mean, like they always come up with some really funny stuff to say. Um, like there was one, um, I saw one tweet they had, like somebody said, um, listening to Wendy's mixtape and then they had like headphones inside of a garbage can, like they were listening to it. Um, and then Wendy's reply with, why are you listening to your own opinions though? Like that was a, that was a nice funny comeback. Like that was that was pretty good. I thought you know, like so they like whoever I don't know who runs that, but they're really good. Yeah, they are savage. Yeah. Um. So I mean, yeah. I, I mean, I I hope they come back with more. I hope they bring Kendrick Lamar to do like McDonald's and they start. Oh nice, lord. You know, just get all the good rappers. It's like fuck it. It's uh, rap is. Yeah. Rap is over. <laughs> Fine, just rap, rap, rap is dead at this point. Anything can be bought. There's no integrity left. Yeah. But speaking of those who do have at least a little integrity left, I don't know. I didn't know if you reviewed it or not, but I just want to give a small shout out to an album I listened to uh, that it? is rap. Uh, it's an album called uh, Whether or Not. It just dropped uh, this year, not too long ago. Mm-hmm. Uh, and it's by an artist called Evidence. Right. Uh, again, whether or not spelled weather as in the weather outside. Uh-huh. Uh huh. And I I quite thoroughly enjoyed the album. I thought it's a kind of a sleeper hit, and I, I feel bad that it's not getting more looks. Right. It's a when lot I, of genuine. You want to review it for next show? We can. Uh, we got yeah, a show. Yeah, I'd love up. to. Okay. Cool. I would love to do that. Honestly, and uh, I sent you the link with it, um, so you have the entire stream of it. Okay. On the hang. Cool. So take a look at it. Yeah. Um, yeah, we can review that next show if you want. Uh, get more <laughs> back into music reviews, doing that. Um, all right, so that was our last topic of the day. Um, so yeah, so I mean, oh, I forgot to give a final score for uh, Wendy's We Beefing. So, oh. um, thumbs up or thumbs. I mean, it's, it's eleven minutes. Maybe you'll get it, like a good laugh out of it and yeah. enjoy yourself. Other than that, that's about it, really. Yeah, I mean, it's it's like I said, generic super trap rap. Anything you could, like the beats sound so generic that like you can find on the internet. Like pick a pick a, a trap beat out of just yeah. like out of a hat. Um, the rap, listen to that. Listen to Hamburger Helper. Yeah, now that one's actual fire. Listen to Hamburger Helper. Uh, the rapper themselves, like they actually they actually kind of sound like they're bored through most of it. Like they just oh yeah, you know, that's what I felt so sad about. It. Like you went through all the effort to kind of get here, and you're just kind of reading off the lines on uh, this is brag rap. I don't know like, if the person actually wrote those lyrics or somebody wrote them for him. Oh, I'm sure know. somebody wrote them for him. Yeah, because I was like, yeah, they sound really super just bored and just uninterested, just disconnected from it. But yeah, it's super short. It's only like 11 minutes. Like, if you want like maybe a good laugh to just see what everybody's talking about, I I say maybe just check it out for that. But other than that, yeah, it's it's 
it's it's trash, but you know, it's it's maybe enjoyable trash. So that's my rating on it. Um, yeah, do you have a, a final rating for it? Nah, same as you, man. Same as you. Hello, thanks for checking out our content. If you liked it, let us know. And if you didn't, let us know that as well. If you want to see more content, we post every Saturday on SoundCloud and YouTube at The Afternoon Tune. You can also find us through various social medias, Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, all one word at The Afternoon Tune. And if you don't deal with any of that social media stuff, you can also find us through our email at TheAfternoonTune at gmail.com. And don't forget to always stay tuned.